I've got bananas, and then I've got safflower oil, and then I've got stone ground brown rice flour, baking soda without aluminum, and with, it's gluten free. Then I have some organic raw blue agave syrup, and then there is sea salt. Okay, not sure if you can see my head, but anyway. Now I'm going to mash the bananas. You want to make sure you get like really dark colored banana peels when you make banana muffins. Add the oil. I've got one fourth cup of safflower oil, a half a cup of agave syrup. You just stir it throughout and make sure that the oil, the agave, and the banana are very well stirred. So there you go. Well, that's in one bowl. In the other bowl, you will need two bowls. You will measure out two cups of flour. one teaspoon of sea salt, or Himalayan salt. Okay, so the next thing that I'm going to add is the baking soda. That's also one teaspoon. Making sure that the baking soda and the salt are mixed within the flour. And now I'm going to add it. So now I'm going to start with a just a normal spoon. So now I'm going to declump the final results. So what I do is I press the mixture to the side of the bowl. I'm going to fill the muffin. While you're doing all this, you should preheat your oven to 360 degrees. What I like to do to grease the tins is I take a paper towel and some oil. Bake on 460 for 25 minutes. So now they're done, and I'm gonna give it a taste and see how they are. Vegan, gluten-free banana muffins. Right now I'm also having a nice green drink that I thought up. It's garlic, probably, I don't know, maybe seven cloves of garlic, if not more, plus three cucumber and three English cucumber and a bunch of red lettuce. And uh, yeah, it's a tad strong. <laughs>